smoke is running underneath Bloomington City streets. But there's no reason to be afraid. The sewer lines are just being tested. Alex Mankey explains. These engineers are looking for parts of Bloomington's sewer system that are in need of repair. To help find those exact spots, they use a smoke test. So any sewer systems that might be experiencing inflow and infiltration or extraneous stormwater getting into the sanitary sewer system, smoke testing is an easy way to find wherever the smoke is coming out of the system, rainwater or groundwater can be getting into the system. Here's how it works. The manhole is opened and a large fan is placed on top. Smoke sticks are lit and the crew goes searching. If smoke is coming out, like this crack of the road and by this house, a flag is placed and tracked. So we document everything with a GPS point on iPads. We also do a digital photograph of everything. You'll see smoke in the roadways and it's possible to even see it in your home too. People who live on the streets tested should run water in the drains they don't use very often. As the crews behind me continue to go street to street in Bloomington, every resident impacted should be getting a placard on how to prepare their home for the smoke test. Let's say you forgot it or you didn't get one and smoke starts to billow up in your basement. The first thing to do is call the fire department so they can help you air it out. And of course, the crews will be alerting the fire department as well. Each test runs for about 15 minutes and can smoke about 400 feet of piping and connectors at a time. Around 15,000 feet of sewer will be filling with smoke during this round of testing. In Bloomington, I'm Alex Minky.